add 20 drops of red food coloring and one tablespoon of liquid dish soap. A tablespoon is a full measuring scoop. Using your stick, mix everything together in the measuring cup. Okay, so one teaspoon of the citric acid. Salt. It does. A little bit, huh? Why does it look like salt? Kind of like, it's just granulated. Granulated means it's in gran, granule shape. Okay, so you want to put it in? The water. Okay. Here, let me hand it to you by the hand. Nice. So remember we did this yesterday, too. Okay, now we need 20 drops of dye. Here's the dye. Okay. Why 20? I think that's this is going to make it red. I think that's the whole thing. I don't know. Ready? So you're Am I going to do it? Do it. Uh -huh. You count, Zach. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. That's half, right? Half. Halfway there? Eleven. Twelve. I got two on that one. Thirteen. Fourteen. 15, 16, 17, 18, 19, 20. Oh, I might get an extra. That's 20. Now it's red. Now it wants us to do, here, you do the squirting, a full one of these. Here, let's set the base right here. And now squirt down. I'm going to fill up this blue thing. All the way to the top. <laughs> okay, I think that's enough. You want to pour? I'll pour. Okay, hang on. Okay, it's really full. They're okay. right about this could get messy, huh? Okay, now we're gonna mix it all up, right? Using your stick, everything together in the measuring cup. Pour next. Pour, carefully pour this liquid mixture to the volcano base. Step back as it gets ready to <laughs> erupt. We may want to get some newspaper for the ground. <laughs> oh no, this is going to be messy. What do you think, Mommy? Maybe move your Lego guys. Yeah, they might get messed up. Mommy. <laughs> My Put them in your pocket, in your, Lego, in your apron pocket. This oh, they didn't want to watch? Oh, it's on Inside Out. Put them in Daddy's pocket. I've got one. Mine is Inside Out? Oh, it's not. Mm -hmm. yes. Oh, it is. <laughs> Mommy, do you think we should put some on the floor? No, I think it's fine. Okay, ready? Oh, no, you want to pour? Yes. You pour in the funnel, okay? It's going to be really, 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 okay. really, really scary. No, it's not. Just pour. Hey, now listen, wait. See the little pour spout? Here's the little pour spout. And do it. So go for it. Go, 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 go. Go, 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 Oh. What sort of noises would it make? How what would it sound like? Do you think? <laughs> Whoa! Is that one gonna pop? It's still going. It smells like strawberries. It does a little bit. <laughs> so it says here, what happened? Did Whoa. your volcano explode? How high did the lava shoot? Did it flow down the sides? Did the volcano make any noise? Did it shake? Look at how it's going down the little rivulets. Rivulets. Once the eruption has stopped, give the volcano a good shake. Does it start erupting again? Listen, fun fact. Volcanic eruptions can change the weather on the entire planet. The biggest explosions produce huge clouds of gas and ash that circle the Earth and can cool the globe for an entire year. Most recently, this happened in 1991 following the eruption of Mount Pinatubo in the Philippines. Whoa. That is erupting. You want to shake it a little bit?